going, man? Hey, there. Um, I hear you want to know about what that jacket's all about. Yeah, I guess yeah. I just found it next to me. So. You found it next to you? So, yeah. well, if you got that, that's a that's a heck of an award. Do you know much about the history of it? No, like, well, I mean, it looks familiar and all that. Let me show you something. See on the inside here? So you got all these names. Yeah. Stretch back here. Goes back from 1964 to 04. Wow. But if you look right there, that's me. That's 90, you? 94. Like that. So wow. this actually is called the Vic Wilson jacket. And um, it's a Poles House tradition that uh, was passed on to me in 1994 from uh, a friend of mine. Poles House tradition it was to pass on the jacket because it started back in the in the 60s um, with a, a guy named Bick Wilson who obviously I never knew. What it meant to me at the time was recognition basically for not only just playing a lot of sports or significant sports but also um, you know being a leader in the sports and that kind of stuff too. So, so uh, but yeah it, it's definitely a tradition that honors not only the past of the school especially Poles House. Yeah and it can go to any sport too so it's a matter of being the, a good role model and leader for the other teams but uh, yeah no I think it's one of the probably one of the the coolest Appleby traditions that that I ever knew about. Yeah it, there, so. it does seem like it. Yeah. I'm Mr. Shields, and I actually used to be the house director um, many years ago, actually for 10 years. This jacket is very special. It's obviously, um, it's seen better days, right? But um, it's really more about uh, what it symbolizes. And for this student to get it, they have to have got their colors in grade 11. At the time when I was house director, if you got colors and you were in grade 11, and you were coming into boarding, it was presented to you uh, for the following year, and you got to wear it for the whole year.